Creating a bootable macOS USB installer is an essential process for installing Mac operating system. If your system is running slow or if you want to make a clean installation or even if you want to downgrade your Mac operating system, you will have to create a bootable USB installer. But the normal and the manual method is a bit complicated where if you are creating bootable USB on the Mac, you will need the terminal process which is not easy to perform. And if you are using Windows, then you will have to go through with a long procedure, finding the macOS image and making a bootable USB. But here only to make this task easier, our sponsor comes in that is iBoyce of Disk Geeker with which you can quickly create a macOS bootable USB with few clicks only. Okay, so bring up any of your browser, then you have to search for iBoySoft Disk Geeker. Once you search and hit the enter key, on the very top only, you will be getting this website, iBoySoft Disk Geeker All-in-One Disk Management Tool. Click on it and you will be getting this kind of website, All-in-One Disk Management Tool for Mac Operating System. Now you can use this either on your Mac Operating System and even if you are trying to create a bootable USB from the Windows device, then you can also do that. As of now, I will be creating the Mac OS bootable USB from my Windows device only. And you can read all the feature here. New download Mac OS Secure, High Sierra, DMG file. Create a bootable installer for Mac OS with one click. Even it provide you many more feature. So just click on free download. The file will be quickly downloaded in a zip file. So open the downloaded folder. Right click on it. Click on extract all. Click on extract. And the installer folder will be up. So make a double click on it. And here you will be getting the disk geeker installer application files make a double click on it or right click on it click run as admin and this will be now loading up and very soon you will be getting this kind of dashboard of the iBoySoft disk giga the dashboard is quite neat and clean on the left and top you find the clone option where you can clone the os disk clone partition clone disk very useful feature below you find the bit locker where you can encrypt your drive using the a bit locker option that this tool provide you. Then on the right hand side, it gives you AI smart disk cleaner. So if your storage is running down and if you want to quickly clean up your disk, then you can go with this AI smart disk cleaner. All right, now the one that we will be discussing today is download and create boot disk. And it gives you for the Mac operating system and even for the Windows. So where it says Mac OS, below you have to click on create Mac OS USB installer. Next, it will ask you the pen drive USB that you want to create a bootable USB. So from the list, you have to select your USB. If it doesn't show in the list here, then reconnect your USB and again check it back. Now on my end, I have disk 2 Kingston Data Traveler that is around 58 gigabyte in space. And even I can reconfirm by opening the file explorer. And also you need to make sure that there is nothing inside this USB as everything will be wiped out. So once you are okay, once you are confirmed, now you can select the USB and click on select. And now finally it will ask you that which OS image you want to create a bootable USB. So it will list you all the Mac OS uh, version like High Sierra, Big Sur, Ventura, Sonoma, Sequoia, Tahoe. That is the latest one. So whichever you want to pick, like I will be going with the latest one. Released in September 2025, that is Mac OS 26 Tehoa. But if you want to go with any other, then you can select that option and then finally click on create boot disk. And that's it. Now you need to sit and relax. It will be automatically downloading the Mac OS image and it will be creating a bootable USB. And this process may take some time as you can see the size is around 17.24 gigabyte. So let's wait until the process is being completed. And once the DMG image file of the Mac will be downloaded, finally it will say creating the boot disk and this won't take much time. So again, you will have to wait. As I said, you just have to make two clicks or one click I can say. And after that, you need to sit and relax and all the work will be done automatically. All right and bingo. So here we go. And it says boot disk created successfully. Alright, so finally you have created a macOS bootable USB installer without doing too much with just few click. Now you need to connect this macOS 
bootable USB to your Mac device. You can boot with it and start the installation or whatever you want to do. So that's all guys for today and hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you really want to make this work easier, then you should definitely try this tool. The link will be in the description. Check it out. And if you have any question, any doubt, let me know in the comment section. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.